So I want to go ahead and model for you how to graph um, using Alex. Um, so here's an example. It says graph the parabola and axis of symmetry. So the first thing you want to do is pick up the parabola tool here. And then you want to graph the vertex. So either doing work or if it's a problem that you can just look at and know the vertex, you want to go ahead and graph the vertex. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now. Let me scooch down. Okay, so then you click on it. Then it says choose how the curve opens. So if you push your mouse up and click, it will mean that the graph goes up. If you think the graph goes down, you're going to push down and click down. So this graph is going to go down. And then it says place another point. So on a piece of paper, you would show work and plug in a random number and calculate um, what that other point would be. So for example, if I want to plot the point when x is 4, let's say, I would get negative 5. And then I would click there. And then there you go. Then I have the parabola graphed. Okay, then it says to also, it says the axis of symmetry needs to be graphed. So the axis of symmetry is the vertical line, so you're going to click the line tool, that goes directly through the vertex. So you're going to draw a line that goes through the vertex here, so click. And then you're going to click again. So if I go over here, then it's not a vertical line. So I'm going to click here. And then lastly, um, this line is not part of this equation here. This vertical line is purely drawn just to show the line that splits the parabola in half. So since it's not really part of that equation, you need to then click this tool here that looks like a dashed curve right here. You're going to click on it and then click on that vertical line and now it makes it dashed. Okay, so that is how you're going to graph a parabola. So be very careful and make sure you read the directions. So in this problem, it says graph the parabola and axis of symmetry. So you only have to graph this axis of symmetry um, when it asks you to. So if we look at this example here, this is um, another homework problem. You will see it just says graph the function. If you look over here in, under the tools, you'll see that the option to draw the vertical line is not here. So for this problem, it's just asking you to graph the function. So again, you would pick up this tool here. You'd find the vertex, either using the vertex formula. Um, so for this one, you'd have to use the vertex formula um, because it's not in vertex form. So you calculate the vertex. I'm just making this up. And let's say you are like, oh, there's the vertex. Then you either need to push up or push your mouse down. So you need to tell the Alex program whether you think the graph opens up or opens down. So in this case, it opens up. And then you need to find at least one other point. So you're going to plug in whatever random number you want for x. And then you're going to plot that point. Now, personally, I would graph on, a, um, on paper. And I would do multiple points because if you only do one point, it's going to look like a parabola, of course, um, because it automatically makes it into a parabola. So I would do more than one point and just make sure it's right and don't just trust that one point that you've plotted on here. Okay, so that is how you graph on Alex with parabolas.